until it is finished I will leave my messengers upon your place and then, they shall be lifted up into the security of my places of safety and light and you who choose to listen not and continue to abandon my truth shall remain outside my city with the sorcerers and the immoral and murderers and idolaters, and all who love to lie, and do so. I have sent my angels and messengers among you to put the word to print and sound and picture in order to tell you these things. Know, that in these times of the sorting that, as time moves on, the vile will become even more vile, good men will be better, those who are holy will continue on in greater holiness. Oh yes, children, I bring your reward with a knee and ye shall bring unto a knee thine markers and we shall measure thine portion. I suggest all of you who can read go on to the book called Holy and Even with its tampering, I commend you to read the book of Isaiah and unto my people say, Mary Shaul has baths. Be ye ready? Do not be foolish in your geography perceptions. The beast of any god shall rise out of the places which claim to be my holy places and the people will claim to be my chosen people, but they are evil and have no truth in them. But it shall be from the places of the ancient days from which the wars shall move across the nations and my reclaimed places shall rise and the infected and evil places shall be given to sink beneath the seas to be cleansed and healed. Where shall ye be? I shall save my people, she urged him. She urged him, and Mary Shaul has baths. Turn thee from the witches and mediums. Listen not longer to their whisperings and mutterings. Can the living find out the future from the dead? Why do ye not ask of me these things? Why do ye not listen, when I send ye the word and the truth? What will ye do? Will ye move away, my people, led away captive, stumbling, weary and hungry? Check the words of those witches, channels, mediums which pronounce things upon which ye hang nine beings, if their messages are different than mine, it is, because I have not sent them, for they have no light or truth within them. They will cry out for new world government and order and promise you peace and prosperity. But you shall reap of the whirlwind for unity of worlds and universes comes only from the lighted truth and life integration within the laws of truth, light and balance within the creation. Man of human distraction knows only lust, greed, power through coercion and force and enslavement. If ye follow the wrong leader you are destined to perish with that leader and lose of all that ye perceive ye have gained in the physical procurement. Ye had best be turning unto the holy books of the lighted realms and discerning that which is truth from that which has been changed and written in by your enemies for the time is at hand. In all times of coming in manifestation in the density of physical, messengers are sent to give warning and set the word to write. Always a prophet is sent for me to bring you into the remembering, but the hourglass lies upon its side awaiting my turning thereof. Ye who have eyes and ears had best be in the seeing and hearing for the glass is empty and the cup empty, with what will ye refill it? Oh yes, the book of Isaiah has been corrupted and the truth turned about, but if ye read with discernment, ye shall find it all written there upon the pages. Remember, that the definition of Israel is God's chosen people, it has nothing to do with a geographical location of a place which plundered and stole the places of Palestine. Ye had best begin to read with definitions of truth instead of those definings, as laid forth to enslave you of the ignorant deceived. Most of the book of Isaiah, as with all the rest of that which is claimed holy is rewritten to suit the needs and intent of those who would claim falsely and take that which is not theirs and you will see, that they of evil have written the lies to dupe you of the world into acceptance of their evil. You are people come of the lie and it shall only be through the movement back within the truth that ye shall regain of your freedom. My Holy Spirit shall not leave you, any of you who shall turn into the wanting of the good and gain hate of the wrong. Rise up, my children, let your light shine for all the nations to witness. For the glory of my light is streaming from you, if you will but take it. Darkness as black as the moonless midnight shall cover all the peoples of the earth, but my glory will shine from you. All nations will come unto your light, mighty kings will come to see this glory of my light upon you. My winged chariots shall fill your skies and there shall be rejoicing in the homecoming. Lift up your eyes and see. For your sons and daughters are coming home to you from distant lands. Your eyes will shine with joy, your hearts will thrill, for merchants from around the world will flow to you, bringing you the wealth of many lands, and has it not been given and you have turned it into spoils and wretched plunder? Oh, despicable and vile are the ones who took my words and promise and made them to read, as the prophets and reward of the very evil anti-god who would seek Zion and call themselves my chosen children and take the heritage of mine own, unto themselves. 
Do you of the male children not see that which they have done? They have taken my truth and turned it unto their own use to fool all of ye nations. They have set up their vile and evil temples in lands not their own so that the world would not know of their evil and think it prophecy. They would set their cities forth in the biblical lands and pronounce that, See, God says that the things of Lebanon would be mine and that Israel would become known around the world and glorified in the eyes of all, nay. You follow the beast into the pits of separation, if ye follow on with this charade. Tis not the god of light these ones follow but the fallen gods of evil adversaries who have mesmerized and captured you in their nets of lies and webs of human physicalness. So be it for the moving finger writes and then moves on, where will ye be, child? Dharma, it is enough. Write herein that God has sent his messengers to every land and said, Tell my people, I, the Lord your God, am coming to save you and will bring you many gifts. And you shall be called the holy people and the Lord's redeemed, and so it shall come to pass in your generation upon that place laid forth for your experience. That which is pronounced in Isaiah is not that which is referred to, as the Israel now placed within the location of Palestine, for they were liars and frauds from the beginning and their messengers fill the lands with the lies and false teachings, and those, too, shall fall in the sweep of truth. Let it be known, that none of evil can nor will stand in my light for all of darkness shall be vanquished. So be it. Sit, Chela, and tell these things for so, as I give it to be written, so shall it come to pass and I send the word for man to know, so that he can choose his direction. I shall no longer stand silent and those who have changed my words and destroyed my truth shall be cast into the silence, for they have pulled my people down and the reward shall be heavy indeed. I close this portion with petition to hear, to see and come into understanding, so that you can find your way. My messengers shall no longer be given into martyrdom, for the call is sounded, as the chaos has spread about your lands, so will the hush come upon you and woe is upon he who does not take heed. I shall rip the books down within the lies from their sowing and rend them into shreds and the lies shall bury the liars in their dens of iniquity and so shall it come to pass for the truth lies within the story but it is not, as written or translated, for they of evil have taken that which was given for your guidance and turned it into the path directly into evil. They who have convulsed my truth shall be strangled upon their own lives. Ah yes, ye had better be reading carefully the books called Bible, for they are filled with the changings to suit of the beast and through them shall ye be led to slaughter, for they are not of my giving. Everything here has been corrupted for the eons of time and ye who were given forth to set it to right have fallen to the wayside or into the pit with the vipers. Not longer shall it be thus, for I am coming to set it to right and ye who stand with me shall be given into greatness. These ones who have stolen that which I gave in truth unto mine people shall be given into the abyss of remorse f. 